Hello, hope you are doing good. I'm your host Jason. In this video, I will be showing you how to make a newspaper on Canva. Once you're on the Canva main page, I want you to tap on the search bar right here and you're going to type in newspaper. After typing in newspaper, you'll be redirected to the newspaper templates page. And the reason why I recommend that you use one of the templates is with these templates, all you'll need to do is simply drag and drop your information. And you can see that you're provided with numerous templates that will make your newspaper look stunning and like it was created by a professional. So all you'll need to do is scroll down and select the template that you would like to use. For example, I will be using this template. So I'm going to tap right there. After you have done that, you can tap on customize this template. Once you have done that, you will be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you will now be able to edit it and add your own personal touches. So all you'll need to do right where you see page one of one at the bottom right hand corner of the page, I want you to simply pull along the slider to the right so you can increase the size of the page right there or the zoom so you can see it even better. After doing this, we can now change out the information on the page at the moment to our information. All you need to do is go over to uploads from the left hand menu option. Then you could tap on upload files and you could upload an image or images that you would like to add. Or you can tap on elements from the top left hand corner. Then from there, you could tap on the search bar and you could search for whatever image you would like to add. So let's say, for example, I'm creating a newspaper and I would like to add some information about a dog on the home page. So I'll tap on dog right there. Then I could select photos. Then I could scroll down and use any one of the photos right here as they are copyright free. So let's say I would like to use this one. All you need to do is drag and place the photo as you can see right there. After you have done that, you can tap on the text box. Then from here, you can double tap and you can start typing out the text that you would like to add. You can change each section by tapping on it. If you'd like to change the font style, you can double tap on the text box. Then tap right where you see this option right here in the top left hand corner. I won't even try to pronounce this word. After you have done that, you can select the font style that you would like to use. Once you're finished, what I would recommend you do is duplicate this page to keep the same layout or the same look going right through your newspaper. So you're going to tap on duplicate page right above the page right there. After you have tapped on duplicate page, let's say for example, the next page is the sports page. I could tap right where you see breaking news and I'm going to simply select breaking right here and I'm going to type in sports. So it will be sports news right here. Let me change the S to a capital S. After doing that, you can remove this section right here. And after removing this section, I can also remove the separation. Then I could carry up the image a bit and I could also carry up this text section and carry up the separation right there. Then you could also carry up the text section as you can see right there. After doing that, you could change this out. So let's say for example, I would like to add some football news. You could type in football right there. After selecting football from here, I could select photos. Then I could scroll down and you can see the different photos right here. I'll simply drag and place that one. Then you could replace this one also. And if it is a case that you would like to use one photo, all you would need to do is delete the other element boxes. So you could delete all of these elements right here. Let us do that real quick. We'll delete these. So I'll delete the photos right here. Tap on delete frame. And we're going to be deleting this section also. So let's do that real quick. And we can delete everything right here. So let's do that. So you'll simply select each section and you're going to remove them. We're going to be removing all of this section right here. After you have deleted them, all you'll need to do now to change the layout, 
let's say we would like the image to be at the top so we'll delete all of the separation right here and we're going to simply drag down the text box then you are going to pull it to the right and you can see right there and we'll simply remove this section also after removing that section let's do that again you can simply tap on the image and you can pull it to the left to increase the size as you can see here then from here you could add in the text information that you want so you could add in your news article right there and you can continue adding more pages so you can simply tap on duplicate again and you can add even more pages if it is a case that you like assistance or you like to change the page layout and you like to use another template also what i would recommend you do is scroll down tap on add page then from here you're going to tap on design in the top left hand corner then you will tap on the search bar and you're going to type in newspaper so let's select newspaper and you can see the different templates again that you can choose from so you can select another template for another section of your newspaper so you can scroll down and you can see the different templates right here if it is a case that you would like to use the old newspaper you could tap on old newspaper and you can see the different layouts that they recommend all you will need to do is simply tap to select one of these options as you can see right here or we can select news article let's say for example we would like to use this layout for a section you could simply tap on it and you can see that it has been added to the page then from there you can start editing each section by tapping there you can also change the images and so on quite easily after you're finished making your changes and it is to your liking you will simply tap on share in the top right hand corner after selecting share you're going to scroll down and you're going to tap on download after selecting download you will select all pages then from there you're going to select download and you will be able to print your newspaper hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe and also if you have any questions that you would like to ask me you can leave them in the comment section and i will respond in a timely manner thank you for watching this video